Hello, hello, hello. How are you doing, Capricorn? Happy New Year's. Welcome to my channel. This is Positive Thoughts and Energy. Happy New Year's. <clears throat> my Capricorns, to all of my subscribers, Capricorn, thank y'all so much. I reached 1K before the New Year's of 2020 went out. I reached 1K and then some. I want to say to all my subscribers, thank y'all so much for your, your love, your likes, your support. Your warm comments. Thank you so much. I couldn't do this without you. I started this channel three months ago. Okay. And um, I tell you, thank you for your support. I'm just humbly grateful. All right. My new viewers, cross watchers, come on in. Take what resonates. Okay. Leave the rest for someone else. Apply the gender roles and reverse the roles, how they fit into your life. All right. And remember, if it doesn't resonate, please check your sun, moon, rising. Okay? It should resonate there. Thank you, Spirit. So, two things I want to say. First, I, new viewers, I do listen to meditation music, different types of music. You may hear sometimes in my background. The second is that my smoke detector started going off yesterday. So, I haven't had a chance to um, go get a battery. <laughs> so, I know. I don't want to hear anybody. <laughs> You'll smoke detector going off in the background. Da, 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 da. Yes, I know. I really know. I can hear it very clearly, okay? I just want y'all to know that I know, all right? So, <laughs> so forgive me for that one, all right? Happy New Year's to you, too. Let's get started with cue cards. I always start my readings off with affirmation cards. They're just cue cards, something to, for you to think about as your day, or also something you can manifest and start to bring into existence, okay? So let's get started. This is for Capricorn. What is the cue card for Capricorn spirit? Okay. I have full, I don't know what that say. And you know what? I've had these cards for a while, and I still don't know what that say. Full sir, sir, sorry, 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 sorry. Maybe somebody can put that in the comment. What this, this what this says? It, it it looks like it's sunshine, beautiful. I see, I see um, the yellow car, the yellow carnations. I mean, the yellow flower. What are they? The sun, sunflowers, beautiful. So somebody let me know what that means. Thank you. So cue cards for Capricorn. Thank you. Do one more, okay? Capricorn. Thank you. All right. All right. Tick, 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 tick. Capricorn. Tick, 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 tick. Something that you have a deadline about. Spirit is saying tick, tick, tick. Time is ticking. Okay. And your next card is Persevere. Perseverance. That's a very strong card. I like that. Perseverance. Thank you. All right. That's your affirmation. Let's see what what spirit, what it says in your, in your love, Capricorn. Mm. You stuck? All right. It's for Capricorn. Thank you, spirit. Capricorn, what's going on in your love, Capricorn? Thank you. All right. Let's see. First card is, oh, Capricorn, someone's wearing a false mask. Someone's wearing a false mask in this relationship. Express your love. Go ahead and make the romantic gesture. For some of you, I feel as though that time is ticking that someone's going to be revealed. Someone's wearing a false mask. And for some of you, express your love. Go ahead and make the romantic suggestion. Go for it. Go for it. You never know. Go for it. If some of you have been trying to wonder, uh, should I take that chance with that person? Should I say something to that person? Should I approach that person? Uh, it just popped out. Yes. Spirit is saying yes. You can trust this person. You can trust this person. This person's trustworthy, loyal, and honest. That just popped out of the deck. So... That answers your question. <laughs> I love spirit. Spirit is awesome. Thank you, spirit. Please give me clarity, understanding, and shield of protection around me. Thank you, spirit. Hmm. 
Okay. Oh, all right. Someone you done cut off. You have the Queen of Swords. Yeah, someone you blocked. Someone you cut off. That's the energy that's around you. Wow. What's going on, Capricorn? A lot of pain. I see a lot of pain here. A lot of you, is it because of this deception? You found out someone was wearing a false mask? Spirit, tell me what Capricorn's breathing is about. What is it that Capricorn needs to know, Spirit? Yeah. All right. I feel like some of you are trying to make a decision. All right, so what I see here, what I see here, Capricorn, is that there's definitely some deceptions going on in this relationship. Oh, there's someone that you were dealing with. I feel like you're trying to make a decision. You're very intuitive. A lot of you are very intuitive, but I feel as though that you are definitely not talking to this person. You have not talked to, you're not saying anything to this person. This person hurt you very badly. This person wasn't reciprocal. You was not happy. There was no independence. There was no, you, you, you just, you know, this person was a player. They had a lot, they had, whew, they had a lot of, a lot of options. And I, I think, I feel like you didn't realize that, that they had a, so much player energy in them. Yeah. Third party situation. Yeah, they definitely were seeing someone else. There was some deception. They was definitely seeing someone else. And it was only a matter of time that you was going to find out. Thank you, Spirit. Holy Spirit. Yeah, I feel like this person didn't care. They didn't hold themselves back at all. I feel like they, they, you knew this person had a third, had a, had another person. They didn't hold themselves back at all from this third party situation. Yeah, they hurt you really bad. Yeah, you had no love for this person. You have no love for this person. Yeah. You have, you know, you definitely, your light bulb came on. You know, I don't know if you knew this or you knew about it, but you're just finding out. Spirit, tell me more about Capricorn's reading. Oh, wow. Yeah. This is definitely somebody from your past, your present past person that you were dealing with. This person wants to come in and they want to collaborate. They see this as something that, that, can, that can work, that can last. Psh, ain't that something? They can see this, but they, they aren't on the receiving side. It's almost like they say, let's work this out. That's what they're saying. That's how I'm perceiving it. That's how I'm intuitively perceiving it, that they're saying, let's work this out. Let's collaborate. Let's work this out. Let's talk about this. But I see you have nothing to say to this person. Yeah, there it is. You haven't talked to this person in a long time. You have both queens. Oh, my goodness. Yeah. But they want to have a, they want to speak. They want to talk. They want to have a logical conversation. They feel like this marriage can be worked on. They see no future. They, they just see happiness with you. Ain't that some mess? 
Ain't that some mess? Spirit, tell me more. This person made you feel less than. Empress in reverse. Empress or emperor. They made you feel like you wasn't nothing. Yeah, you have no hope of faith in this connection, Capricorn. Okay, there's a lot of lies and deceitfulness. They just, they just, a lot of deceptions. Then the tower knocked that down. Yeah, tower knocked that over. You're not interested whatsoever in this person. This person could have been trying to manifest you back into their life. But this person, let me tell you the mindset of this person. The energy that's coming, that's coming in. This person feels as though that this can be fixed. That, that this can work, that this can last, that let's, collab let's collaborate, let's work on this. This is what your person, past person, present person is saying. Someone that you have blocked, you have not talked to in a very long time. You have not talked to this person in a very long time. You're not interested. They hurt you tremendously. When you found out that they had a third party, I feel like some of you really, you caught this person in action with someone else. But let me tell you something. Let's fast forward it to now. Somewhere in their thought, in their little weak minds, mm, let me let me just control myself. All right? Cross watchers, you're probably going to get pissed off. But I'm just saying, somewhere in somebody's mind, you really thought, or you really think that y'all can come together and work on this marriage, that you can collaborate, that you really feel like that this can work. After you done deceived this person, you done deceived and you have hurt their heart, you had them in third party situations, and you have the nerve, the nerve to think that's almost like an insult. Cross watches, that's an insult. You're like, it's like you're saying, okay, I played with your your mind, but it was or it's like you coming to this back to your wife or your husband and you saying, you know what? That wasn't nothing. It just happened. It was in the moment. It wasn't nothing. It wasn't what you thought it was. I just got caught up. Let's try to work on this. Let's try to make this work. That didn't mean nothing to me. Capricorn. Really? Cross watches. Really? Really? So that's the energy that's coming in, Capricorn, that your partner's saying, oh, that's not nothing. That wasn't nothing. It wasn't what you thought it was. No. You say, mm, mm that's okay. I'm good. Somebody say, mm, mm that's okay. I'm good. Reverse the roles in your life how they fit, okay? But cross watchers, that, that's not cool, cross, cross watchers. People have feelings. You know, you can't just expect when someone catch you in the act, you know, and you think that they're supposed to, just, you know, pick up the piece and say, you know what? It wasn't nothing. It wasn't what you thought it was. Let's work on the marriage. Let's have a logical conversation. Let's work on this. Let's, let's build with this. Let's try to make it work. <sighs> Capricorn. Okay. I'm going to let that go. This is Positive Thoughts Energy. Happy New Year's. Till next time.